What's up guys, welcome back, I'm Pope John Paul and we are here with another episode of our 1212 AD campaign for, uh, as England. And uh, we are, in the last episode we tried to make an assault on Wales and uh, we found out it was more well defended than we thought. So I've decided to pull back and regroup there. We did take Paris which was the main achievement of the episode. Um, so we will then push on for Orleans and then Lyon and then we have destroyed France once and for all and then we can focus on Scotland and Wales and unite uh, the main part of the United Kingdom basically um, so we haven't got much else to do I'm probably just going to uh, not, probably not do a lot really I've been told by uh, uh, to decimate my armies if I want to uh, improve the integrity I'm probably going to execute some uh, people here as well that will improve their morale um, and I may do it here. Oh, wrong one. Um, I may des... Actually, this one's not too bad for now. So I'll hold that one as it is. And we will end the turn, I think. Oh, no, we won't. Uh, danger to low, fist the... Oh, no, we'll execute... Yeah, well, we should be executing there anyway. And I may assign a provincial governor still. Oh, London needs one. Okay, yes. So, rider or melee? Um... John. Um. I'll just go with John. Can have it. He's probably. I don't really mind if my infantry don't have any uh, generals, uh, any experience. Cavalry would be kind of more apparent if it'd be kind of more useful if they have it. Um, and we could spend our money on a Catholic priory. I'd rather not. So we'll end the turn and we'll see what happens get on with this campaign so if you guys are enjoying this campaign if you are please leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here uh, no I will not be joining your wars please stop talking while I'm trying to talk so yes if you're enjoying then leave a like and subscribe and uh, the support is very much appreciated so uh, as we'll see what happens their demands they arrange a marriage is this one of my children Arrange marriage. Yeah, it's going to hit them. Yeah, I'll take the four grand. I don't really need Isabella. I presume that was John's ex-wife. We don't really need it. We consider it wise to seek um, between us. To the hope yeah, sure. I mean, nine hundred would be handy, but I probably could have got more out of you. Um, we're gonna march on Orleans next. Um, I'll probably send my priest there. Go and have an investigation. Leon, we can see is undefended. Um, so we'll probably go for that. Bordeaux, I may rush one of the armies back to Bordeaux, just in case they try and think. But I think it's well garrisoned. Um, so if they try and make an assault here, the French, I think we will push them back. Much Provence wants peace. I suggest that we I'll give them peace if they the do it for sides. more. A thousand is more than is more what I was looking at. So that's fine. Um, so we'll take that peace, and then we will... Oh, we need to hand over a hand over a guy. Um, we could go with experience or leader. Leader's possibly better. Peter, I'm gonna go with Peter because he gets experience. Natural causes. Paris. Oh no, Bordeaux has smallpox as well, so that's not brilliant. So we could march on Carnarvon again. Try again. Peace has been sorted out. Holy Roman Empire and France are now at peace. Good thing we made the attack on them first. So we are doing some stuff. Execution. Um, yeah. Okay. So there we go. Perfect. We've got some executions being done. They're fairly fairly healthy. I could make a push. I'm going to just see what the this guy can see. There is a French army now outside Lyon. There's not one outside Orleans. So we're just going to push in for Orleans. Um, and the inheritors of power can occupy Paris. While that happens, we will siege. What could we siege with? Oh, we'll siege with towers. Towers always handy. And then you can march in there, and you can occupy that. Um, I'll mine get some billmen because I've been told they're quite good, and I need to save some air, some room for this ca some cavalry in this army. Um, what have we got here? We have a decent garrison, mainly of archers. Some ca um, decent stuff. They're very low on. Integrity though, so they I don't think will That's got to be enforced. That's double time. Yeah, so they're definitely not going to reach me 
this turn for an attack. It will be next turn. I have 13,000. I could build a church. I'm pretty sure I wanted to build one here in Nottingham. Build a Catholic one. Ca well, ca obviously a Catholic church. Yes, we'll build a Catholic church, please. Um, I am going to just... I'm going to send this army out. And York will take a little hit, but that's fine. 11... 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So they are going to have one more than me, but I think I could take them. Oh no, because I don't have any archers. This is the only problem. Where do I? Where am I recruiting archers? I'm recruiting them here in Colchester. So I'm going to recruit an army here. Eric can lead this army. The Wrath of Heaven. And he can recruit a load of archers. I just need loads of archers, Eric. Can you do that for me, Eric? Three archers should be enough. Um, I will wait the two turns here on the edge. Actually, I could raid. raid. In, I'll raid inside next turn, harass them, and then we will uh, make a push very, very soon. Paris, I'm sure, can do something. Um, I don't really need this here. What's this doing? Food is not a problem here. I guess I could put in a tavern. Do we have a tavern? No, we have a fairground. What's this? Uh, a pageant wagon. A noble domesne we could get. I don't really need one. Tavern. There we go. A tavern. Excellent. Well, you're perfectly what we need right now. Um, I have plenty of longbows in this army. I could get more, but I don't really need any more. Um... I'm trying to see what else I could do, really. Not much else in the way of stuff I could do. You're still not happy. Why are you not happy, then? No reason I can really stop. Taxes are not going to be helped by this. So, fairground. This is actually not helping public order. I could put a tavern in here instead, then. I probably will. I'm going to just do that. Put a tavern in. Then I could always put a military thing in here after. So, we'll do that. Because what's this doing? This is helping... Well, actually, this is helping a lot with commerce, so I'm going to just wait. I could put a tavern in here. Because it's only going down by minus one. Um, so we'll save that from being destroyed right now. Um, we're nearly at plus five here, so this should be able to grow very soon. That'll be excellent. Minus two here. Well, that's a shame. Um, but not much we can do about that. And you're nearly at seven, so that's perfect. Okay, well, in the turn... And we'll see what happens. First time in a while we've run out of nearly run out of money. Spent it all. They want peace to France. Do not give gifts lightly. Sorry, but my aim is to destroy you, France. France is coming up with an army though. Interesting. How many how many men do you have? I think we could defeat this army. What are these made up of? These are pretty weak thing, uh, weak men. These are, yeah, these aren't great. They have some decent cav. I don't think it'll match mine. I have better infantry and I have the longbows. I'm gonna fight this one, so I will see you on the battlefield, ladies and gentlemen. So we are back on the battlefield and I have my army set up. We have longbows in the front, we have our sergeants in the first line of infantry, we have our billmen on the f supporting on the flanks of our second line and our English foot knights in behind. We have our mounted sergeants over here. Let's have a quick look at these guys. These guys look... I don't think we've seen these guys yet. They look very, very nice. Repping the English three lions and then we have our... our uh, general back here, Alfred, in, look at that, look at that armor, and the, those colors, red and gold, just amazing, the longbows here, famous longbows looking ready and ready, raring to go, we have our sergeants, and our English foot knights, excellent, so, let's beat these French, it's not Agincourt, but it could be, for all we know, it could be just like Agincourt, we are outnumbered, as usual, the English are always outnumbered in these fights, so we're going to try and beat this army quickly before the second one appears. We massively outnumber this one two to one. Um, and we can overwhelm their cav. Where's the enemy approach? Behind us. Okay, yes. Yeah, a good thing we're pushing forward. We're, in, we're trying to defeat this army. We're going to try and divide two. Um, I imagine I just keep this cav out here. 
Um, archers, you're definitely, yep, you're on that. So heavy shot, perfect. Gonna be brilliant for these cavalry. French Chevalier is what you're on fo focusing on, lads. So you focus on them. Um, and then send forward the infantry. Actually, bring in the cav. Why aren't we bringing in this cavalry? Okay, perfect. Where did that cavalry come from? They have a lot more cavalry than I expected. Wow. They have a lot of cavalry here. And then send in... Uh, send, bring back the general then. <laughs> I did not see all this cavalry here. Um, right, so, you go in there, hold your line, go in there, charge in, what else can we do, we can send forward the infantry I guess, send forward the infantry, why are you not attacking, please? Actually, no, go, don't. Kill them. Um, you focus down... Anyone and everyone. Who are they attacking? Okay, the uh, other army's a long way away. We're probably going to lose the, quite a lot of our cavalry in this fight. Um, that is to be expected. Um, let's focus down their general. Very dishonorable, but we are English, so we do that. Um, you go in there and kill these guys. You go in there and support them. Cavalry, get in the rear and start killing their um, archers off. Well, not their archers, their other stuff. Right, you're breaking stuff here. We've lost all our sergeants. It's a shame. Um, I might need you to go in here and kill these guys. Can you kill these guys off, please? Um, no, on you, please. Kill these guys. Um, focus these men down. You're just getting run around out the back for no reason. Did that carry broke? Perfect. Focus this lot down. Focus these chevaliers down. You're being held up back here, which is not great. Okay, we broke their infantry. Perfect. You're going to have to go in here. You hold this line. You're going to have to hold against just about the entire French army, um, which is not going to work. Oh, no. Cavalry, go in here. Cavalry, kill these guys. Infantry, you're going to have to hold. This is a pretty crappy army of infantry, though. Can you pull out and save yourselves? Probably not. Yeah, thought as much. Right, so we pull our general back. Stop shooting in there now. Start shooting these guys. Yeah, thought they might. Um, you charge in here. You charge in there. Um, you start running down these guys. Generals will go out here. You're gonna have to start shooting these crossbows. Uh, swords also go in here. Swords over here, please. Swords over here. Oh, these guys are getting beaten up for no reason. Though. There's no need for them to be. Archers, archers. Um, turn and face there. We don't need you over here. Cavalry, you run down these guys. Right. You all chase on these men. Right. Now you can kill these guys. Set about killing these men. Kill these men. A general... Oh yeah, we've lost like all our cav, but at this point it's kind of... They're kind of fine with me being lost. That's, that's fine. I'd rather lose my cavalry than the infantry at this point. The infantry needs to hold. So, it looks like it's probably doing a good enough job. Um, focus these chevaliers down, please. I've left that archer unit very exposed, but it's a price I'll have to pay. Yeah, that's the that's the sergeant's gone. Rather lose this, again, rather lose the sergeants, I think, than the uh, knights. But whether we'll regain them, who knows? Um, send you in. We've got reserves, but. There we go. Go in, go in the rear, sergeants. Kill them all. Yeah, those billmen are never going to catch them. That's a shame. Needed a better unit really to do that, but we'll never find. Could use with that cavalry. Uh, let's just, I guess I could just.
tell the archers to shoot these guys down now. They're, they're not needed here. Uh, cavalry go over there, kill those our ballistas. Um, these guys will just, yeah, now work, work down the line. Our general's for oh great, he's just always been doing his fight and flipping archers. Well, that's going to make it interesting. Don't, cannot believe he fell. Um, archers keep shooting these guys down. And you just chase these men down then. Because there's no point in using you elsewhere. I cannot believe they fell. Uh, both chase these guys down. Wow. My general died. I'm not even sure how he died. He might have died to a, an arrow. I'm not sure what. I'm giving you the attack order, man. Try to kill these guys. I am not going to try and do... This is very much in my favour, but... I need to get you, like, round the back. I'm almost pulling these guys through to then break them. That's worked, actually. It's very cheesy, but it's worked. And in this scenario, I need it to work. There we go. We killed these guys. Right. Can you chase these men down? Oh, I'm not going to have anything to chase these archers. Yeah, that's those cavalry gone. Brilliant. Could do with some archers to kill these men. And the general's broken, but that doesn't really matter because we're going to get a new one. So this has been a little bit of a disaster, but it's not been the end of the world. These, ca these uh, archers here are going to have to get sacrificed. I have a feeling. These billmen are going to be shattered. I'm trying to say something. We've got no cav now to chase them. Chase their archers. So that's brilliant. Um, they've gone into combat. Perfect. Right. Shoot the next ones. What were these? These are just archers. Well, they're going to get killed very easily. Let's see a little bit of fighting going on down here. In the forest. Yes, you do me proud, men. Well, that was a little stressful, I won't lie. I didn't realize they had as much cavalry as they did, and that has kind of undone me a little bit because I've sacrificed more cavalry than I'd like to. Um, but everything else, we've we've done well, and we will take Orleans because of this, but at quite a cost. You're exhausted now. We're actually catching you. Can you just turn around and face these guys and shoot them? Very close range. Um, stop skirmish mode. Just get these guys. Shoot these men, please. Get a volley off. There we go, victory. Ah, excellent. We didn't have to sacrifice those men. So we'll end it. A heroic victory it was indeed. Good God. I mean, yeah, what? we lost a lot of stuff. Um, those cavalry, though, they're getting 268. I think we'll get most of our units back, obviously, apart from our general... We might lose those sergeants. But, I mean, what a victory. I mean, we're not going to... We may not take this city. But we killed a lot of it off. And the siege will be a lot easier now. So, hopefully, we should be okay. So, I will uh, not end this... Uh, I won't bother with this because it's loading nicely back in. Perfect. So, let's see. Poor Alfred has died. Which is a shame. Here's the only unit we're going to lose. We'll replenish... We'll take some Frenchmen into our ranks. It disgusts me to say it, but we will. And then we've beat. Then the Toulousean army has helped destroy them as well. I respectfully request non aggression with Trier. That's fine with me. You can take the 500 as well. Norway moving around. That's nothing to worry about too much, really. So that's fine. And then we'll uh, hopefully have no other issues in this end turn. No one else trying to attack us. So I hope you guys are enjoying this campaign uh, as much as I am. It's actually very enjoyable playing as England. I thought there was going to be a lot more uh, 
tough decisions to make along with magnum cards but we got onto ruon very quickly that was good so duty calls alan we have no choice but to give it to you alfred died doing his doing his duty so that's fine that's what he's here for so we can actually take this very easily now i will i hopefully won't lose any cavalry if the ai sent my cavalry in to die i'm very annoyed because it's gonna be very hard to procure, procure some new ones nope Oh, no, we lost that one. Oh, we lost some sergeants. It's not the end of the world. As long as it wasn't the knights. Ready for orders. Orleans, right. Um, we will... Uh, hmm, do we have anywhere producing? Here is producing mountain sergeants. And then it's... So we could get our sergeants from there. So we're gonna... I am gonna just put put you down here to mobilize to help with this that. So we'll just do that. We will put a town barracks in here. We'll have a noble domesne, we'll have a field, and we will put in a. I could put in a watermill. Um, what do you really. Ha Why are you hating me so much? Just conquest. Apart from that instability. Apart from that, I can't say. I would say devastation is also going to go down. So, I mean, we could just put in a. We could put in a watermill. I think I will put in a watermill. We'll have a watermill. So that's good. So Alan has already upgraded just because he's just there on the scene. So we'll have uh, plus two and authority, I think. Perfect. So what could you. You could recruit some stuff straight away. Um, you only got one unit down, though, so I'm not going to bother because I want it to be an extra cavalry unit. Maybe knights. I don't really want more sergeants. They weren't actually that useful, it would seem. Um, and then we've got population surplus over here in Bordeaux. So we'll sort this out. Do we have a sanitation problem here? Is sanitation really a problem here? I can't tell. Because... Well, we've got have got disease at the moment. Details, right. Here we go. Bordeaux. Um, I could kick him from office. <laughs> um, I could rename the settlement pestilence. Oh, I'm probably being blind and not being able to see sanitation. Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna. I might put sanitation, but it does mean I increase the Jew uh, the Jewish influence here. So that's not so good. Um, I could put a lepros. Oh, I could put one of them in. Yeah, we'll have sanit. That can help with sanitation. That's fine. Um, that's actually perfectly fine. Then we could also always build a wine trader if we wanted to. A wine trader. Um, they're gonna. Yeah, I thought that might be the case. That'll take three turns, so we will not be doing that. Um, I might do some expensive diplomacy. Actually, no. Wait a minute. Let's look at my faction first. Catherine. No, Catherine was my old per person that was married. Richard is nearly of age, so that's fine. Richard of Li Richard Lionheart. No, he's dead. And John's dead. Will this whole, like, all these did it. I think that's Henry. That's supposed to be Henry the Second. That's not great. Um. Anyway, let's. Oh, and this guy's of age. Henry here is of age. Could declare him heir. I might make him heir after, so we have someone of age to become heir. Um. Commander. I could. I'm gonna siege Carnarvon. Carnarvon can go under siege. Put siege towers in place. If they come and attack me, they come and attack me, and we can just do to them what we did to the French. We can push them into the, push them back. The wrath of heaven is getting ready, and we'll produce more forces here. I kind of want some billmen. They were pretty handy against Cav. I can get one. Um, we can afford more. We can just get some expensive diplomacy going. Your people's reputation goes before Yeah, I thought you would. Find a welcome here and speak as you wish. You're how poor are you? There we go. We are a proud people. I'll come back to you. Another time. Another time, perhaps. Um Duchy of Austria. Welcome. Can welcome, you do anything? My friend. Moderate no, I'm not taking any of your moderate stuff. On behalf of our people. Welcome. Hi, there we go. Speak, I, then I can get. I know I can get some money out of you. There we go. Thirteen hundred. That's more than enough to 
fund an army for a little bit. So we'll take your funding. Put some more billmen in. No, five's, five turns is excessive. I might want to move the army up to York or Nottingham by that point to prepare for an invasion of... Uh, Ed well, take Edinburgh and then on to Inverness. What have these guys got? Scottish longbows, Highlanders. These guys look pretty awful, pretty weak. Uh, Pike Shiltron, maybe a little problem for Cav, but they've got a lot of negatives, it would seem. Uh, and we can't see any of theirs, so that's... Uh, well, it's not okay, but it'll have to do. Um, what can we see here? We can s they just got longbowmen. Everyone seems to have longbowmen. If you're just like a mate, not if you're a minor area around here, you have longbows. The Irish certainly wouldn't have had longbows in this period, or ed or any period. Um, and then I could do stuff here, but I won't bother. And I could recruit more, but again, I want more cavalry. Um, and this place is the only place you can really get cavalry. Mounted sergeants, and these ain't aren't great. I might send this army out soon to go and deal with this one. So th yeah, 15 against 8, we should be okay. We'll end the turn and we'll see what happens. Hopefully, no more strange assaults from France. Well, we're going to have a priest attacking us instead. That is a, that is an assault of some sort. That won't be tolerated. Leon will burn for this. <laughs> and the French are making a few moves and Toulouse is now responding. So, I mean, we're going to have to deal with them. It's good, though, that England is dominating France. I will not lie. It's been good. It's good to see. Henry V uh, and Edward III couldn't quite manage this, but it seems like Catherine, who's Queen Regent, can manage it. And it'll be Richard, I don't know, well, the, because the second, uh, who will carry on and t take on the duty of uh, being king. I could make him heir. These people trouble us greatly. No, I'm not joining your war against some Arabs. Peace. Wales, no, you will not have peace. If you, yeah, I thought you'd declare, uh, declare you'd attack me doing this. They've got seasickness. <laughs> and due to the unwieldy nature, that they will uh, disembark from the safe along with the coast and flow on the land. Okay, so we could run down their cavalry. Yes, we will fight this battle. And destroy them too. Excellent. Right. So we'll destroy these guys. And then uh, we'll see where we get to with that. So hopefully... I mean, I didn't realize... Oh, God. This is an interesting map. Um, we will see what can happen here. I will, again, make a quick cut. And I, you will rejoin me on the battlefield. So, we have our archers in the front for this battle. We only have two units of longbows, which I didn't realize how bad this uh, was, but it should be okay. Longbows did get a fair few kills in the last battle against the French, but um, we have a lot of cavalry, a lot of English knights to ride down any cavalry that they put against me this time. So, which is probably what I needed more, was more cavalry. We have some sergeants, we have a front line of English foot knights and sergeants, and we have... Axe Sergeants and Billman in the second line to support if a cavalry charge happens. We need to quickly find that cavalry force that has landed immediately and run them down. Um, and then we... Here they are, straight ahead of us, right? Kill these guys quickly. And then they... Then, we'll, then I want to kill the landing force. And then we'll kill the rest. Oh, no, I do not want to do that. Um, no, do something like that, but not that. So go here. Go here. And then go here, you fools. That was a terrible bit of... You charge in there. You charge in there. You charge in there. And you charge in there. Oh, no. Kill them, you fool. This is awful weather. Why did the Welsh? Why is it always horrible in Wales? And why did the Welsh choose this as a good decide, as a good idea to attack? So we'll overwhelm their cavalry with. Uh, yeah, of course the enemy's going for their general because I sent the general in. Um, archers definitely don't fire, so hold your fire. No, no firing at will. You're not allowed to fire at will. And also get to the front. Why are you like that? So we'll send those sergeants in. They're miles away. The ships are quite a long... Oh, no, this is another army as well? What's this? Oh, these are the ships over here. 
So this is just a support army. Well, we need to route those. Oh, they're sending in cavalry already. Okay, so we're routing these guys. We're losing to that general, though. Focus on the general, then. I don't mind if we kill our own knights doing that. Um, send in some infantry. This is going to turn into a bit of a, of a mosh. Um, send them ahead. They can try and support. Send the billmen up. Actually, where are they landing? Hmm, I don't know. They're not landing anywhere in particular right now, so I'm going to just focus on killing these guys. The enemy have rallied their units. Well, good for them. Um, kill these men. Um, knights run these men down. Knights support. Let's see. What are you doing? Let's see what the damage these guys are doing. Right, so they're running everything down here in sight. Um, I need you to go over here. General, you need to pull back. Yeah, I'm not surprised. But that's just the sergeants. They're not actually that good. They're probably the, some of the weakest melee uh, cavalry I've seen yet. I won't lie. They've got English knights here. Well, I'm going to pull these guys back just out of safety. General can come to here. You come over here. You come over here. Kill their general and we win this battle. They've got a lot of mounted sergeants themselves. No wonder they're losing this battle. Um... Where are their archers? Focus down their archers in the rear. Oh, we have spare billmen. I'm going to just... I'm going to put these over here ready to face that way, just in case they land. Archers, face over there. Thank you. Let's just get back into this carnage of a battle. Uh, no, get out of there, actually. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. Oh, these guys are getting just focused down for no reason. They've broken, and they didn't need to break. They're going to die, and that is a shame. But it happens in war. We have a lot of reserves. I need to keep moving these guys up. Archers, why are you moving so slowly? Kill these men. Uh, now we'll run into the back of these men. There we go, perfect. Right, kill these men off. Uh, kill these men off. Axe sergeants. I haven't actually seen these guys. Let's have a look at these guys. Oh, yes. I mean, I didn't expect much else. Just badly defended men with axes. Um, yeah, they're going to probably do a lot of damage to some horses. Um, okay, we've got plenty of heavy cavalry here. What do we have? Sergeants. Okay, why are you back here? You shouldn't just be lingering around at the back. Um, yeah, run all these archers down. What's the better for you to do, really? Who are these? Billmen. Oh, these are going to be a bit of a problem. I think uh, these, they should easily be dealt with though by, right, just, just keep killing these guys, just run them down, these billmen shouldn't hold, keep killing, keep killing, um, run these guys down as well, the billmen have, <laughs> like on the flank has still not actually met any resistance, archers you might as well turn ready to receive anything that comes over here. Um, these guys are losing ever so slightly. Where have they rallied? Um, these, uh, those guys. Um, yeah, you just keep running down those spears. You fight them off. Uh, and there's not much else I can do. Look at these cowardly Welsh. Just fight those guys, I guess. Uh, ride these guys down, please. It's just English knights riding down cav uh, riding down archers today. It's very much the opposite of what would uh, what would be happening in reality. Really, it would be uh, English archers trying to defend against well French knights, and it'd be w quite a lot of Welsh as well. A lot of Welsh in the uh, in the English army. Are they going to land their forces, or are they just going to just stand there and just die? I don't need all these infantry over here anymore. Don't need you over here either. Um, you ride into them. Uh, actually, I'd like you to go and... Um, I guess someone needs to be facing them. What are you doing? You go over there, please. Oh, so you're out of sh arrow shooting range. Um, yeah, you're going to run. Run for the hills. So we're going to run you down. Oh, this is going to be good to watch. That is nice. Very easy now. 
I can actually appreciate how glorious this looks instead of microing because they just charge a will with at you here. So, I mean, I do apologize that you've not had much to enjoy and watch. Why are so many? Oh, I apologize. Why are so many of you guys dying all of a sudden? Can you just kill these guys, please? Because apparently we're losing this battle. That's got to turn it around, surely. Yeah, they'll run to the they'll run to the line and break. They're they're breaking as well. There we go, perfect. Right. So all this cavalry. Where's the where the flipping egg is the coast? Are these guys finally they're still not landing. Still not landing. Go here. Go there. Go there. Go somewhere like there anyway. General can go behind the arches. You can just go up here somewhere and get some killing done. And you go up here as well, get some killing done. I don't know, just do something. He's got them Welsh are just like infuriatingly not landing. Can they even land, I wonder? I wonder if the ships actually work in this game and actually will land. If not, then I'm going to have to make a surrender and they're going to win for no reason. Or maybe they're just like, I can't see the enemy, so they, they're not going to land. Here they come. Here they come. They're landing. Finally flipping. No, they're getting closer. Not quite landing. You allergic to land or something? I am actually... This is incompetent. That's why you don't put the Welsh in charge of a navy. You should be able to see the enemy now. This is... They're not... They're not a lot... They're not that far away. Oh, God. Useless. How much ammo have we got left in our... Oh, we've actually got plenty of our ammo. They won't fire, and that's why, probably. Um, I'm going to put you right on the front line, then. We've got flammable... We've got flaming shot. We got flaming shot. We'll burn these men down. Burn these men. Are they gonna come in and land this time? <gasps> this is it. You can they're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. They've got three lines on their flipping You're not the three lines. You've got no right to claim the English. Yep, kill these men. Burn them. Burn them. Oh, they're going to land now, so we don't need to have that. Heavy shot is perfectly fine now. They've landed. Excellent. Right, so we can go to normal speed. Uh, cavalry, run these men down. Actually, just someone run the men, the men down. Um, let's get a bit cl closer with these guys so we are ready to actually like receive them when they're going to land. How many men did we lose? Oh, we didn't. Uh, they're just being knocked over by cavalry. Yeah, these guys should definitely die pretty quickly when they arrive on the land. Um, get the rest ready. <laughs> it's just going to be a... Okay, so you land, you die. Um, there, and general... Uh, those axe sergeants might as well have joined the battle, but they'll never re arrive in time. Uh, perfect. Right, so you start shooting these guys. You start shooting these guys as well. <laughs> these guys are not even going to make it off the land. They're going to make it to land. Oh, God. Kill these guys as well. These poor, poor, poor Welsh. They've landed, they're landing on their own coast to die. Charge, men. Show them who the real British are. They're not, we're not British yet. We are still English. And that's. I'd rather be that. Rather than being involved with those Welsh people. Ugh. Don't like them. Uh, just run these guys down. I mean, what is the point? I mean, actually, archers, just hold your fire. Just stop firing. It's just not worth it. Oh, my gosh. They're jumping from miles away. I've never seen that. Uh, Cavalry can just charge in, just do something. There we go. We're running these guys down. Oh, these spears got off. 
Uh, oh, I should run these guys down. You kill them. Can we at least see a view? Ah, uh, this is a d it's okay. We can see something. Right, time to wrap it up, boys. Kill the rest off. Then we take Carnarvon. We can then recruit some stuff there. Excellent. Run these men into the sea. End the battle. Heroic. And we got Boatman. Or Boatmen. No idea what that is. But who cares. We are going to have a fine victory. And what a name that guy is. De want Or however you say that. I've definitely butchered that name. But who cares. I mean look at those Mantis Sides. got three kills. And they all died basically. Those just weren't worth bringing to the battlefield. I'm definitely going to not bother recruiting more of them. Um... I'll probably just get some knights in to replace it. Just make it six units of knights. That'll be an insanely good army. Some longbows would be handy. I could always get rid of some of those axe sergeants. They're impressive, but you need to always replace stuff. Uh, we'll replenish. And there we go. Carnarvon will be ours next turn. Excellent. So we will probably wrap up the episode with the capture of Carnarvon and Orleans. Build something in the religion chain. Well, I can do that. We'll just quickly take Carnarvon. <laughs> so here we go. We take Carnarvon. Stabbed in the chest. Excellent. So now we have Wales under our thumb. I could subjugate, but that's not happening. We occupy. The Welsh are not allowed to live any longer. Um, we'll just repair all this. Um, we'll build a mustard grounds here. That's fine. Um, that allows us to get quite a lot of stuff. Hobblars, I presume, are pretty bad as well. They're probably worse than mounted sergeants. Um, I could just get another archer, another unit of archers. Um, what does this allow me to get? Then that goes down. Mounted sergeants. In yeah, I'd have to go quite a way down for that. Ruan has got a population surplus, so we will produce... I cannot build, I don't have the sufficient sums. Time for some expensive diplomacy. We need to get a n place to recruit better troops on the continent. So we're going to go with uh, Duchy of Austria. You, on behalf of our people, you want some. I know you want some. Uh, I will demand 600. We are a proud 300. <laughs> Thank you. Um, Burgundy. Hail. As not aggression, no. I want... Oh, I have arranged marriage, I've just realised. I could arrange a marriage with Welcome. you. I could demand the wife for Henry. And your I could... This is not a bad idea. You're not too bad either. Um, That's just high. I could demand money. <laughs> could I demand all this money? They'd say low. Damn it. She's quite good though. I'll take her. I'll take her for free. I'm not going to just hang around for that. Um, town barracks, no. I still need more money. A lot more money, actually. Um, Dauphine of Venoir. Trade, yes. We'll take your trade. Um, moderate. 900, it's low. Let's just make it 600. Low, 300. My gosh, has no one got any money in this part of the world? No. Oh god, they get, they're being pushed back by the Muslims. So no wonder they want me to join this war. I may join if you get any use. If I, uh, well, I actually, I don't think I'll get any use out of it. I won't be around long enough to do it. So let's see, where was it? I want a muster grounds. There we go, perfect. So we have our muster grounds. I can now take, oh no, we've taken Orleans already. I've forgotten. We could start the siege of Lyon. I might do that. We take this settlement, indeed. Um, start the siege, we'll put some of that in. And we're going to move our army over here to attack this chap. Paris will take a little negative hit, but that's only because of raiding. Um, and then we will upgrade this chap and his army. So we'll do morale and then we'll do integrity. That'll help boost that. Then we'll put in... Armour uh, for commander's unit, replenishment, and authority. Excellent. So there we go. Wales has been conquered. The French are nearly dead. And, uh, well, we're basically done almost in this in this theatre. 
We have some uh, people to marry off very soon. Looks like Henry is going to Henry's a statesman. I can I don't know. We probably make him. We might make him a general in time. Who knows? Um, but if you guys have enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and subscribe. And until next time, guys. <laughs>